Hello and welcome to day 10 of fall in Stardew Valley here at the Hannibal Show. So uh, let's start off like we always do. We're gonna be... yeah, let's do the weather report. Ah, you know what? There is a rerun of the Queen of Souls. Oh, what could that be? Greeting, it is I, the Queen of Souls, here to teach you a new mouth-watering recipe from my secret cookbook. This week's dish... Stir fry is a perfect way to get some healthy greens on your plant. Uh, Salty the green in a little seasoned oil and make sure to add plenty of fresh ginger and garlic. Now breathe deeply. <gasps> oh, that's good. Okay, you we already had to make that. But let's uh, have a look at the weather report. Welcome to um, Kuzu 5. Uh, let's just skip right. Oh, it's gonna be raining tomorrow. Interesting. And a fortune teller. Oh, I see a glimmer of a glimmer of it in my screen orb. A shard of knowledge from the future. Spirits are very displeased today. Oh gosh. Alright, let's go out and have a... Uh, hello. Hello? Oh, it's Demetrius. Hi, Hannibal. I have some good news for you. A few days ago, I made a breakthrough in my research on the local environment. I'll spare you the technicality details and get to the point. You know that empty cave over there, a little ways to the west? Well, I have a way to turn it into something useful. Oh, that's nice. For both of us. Yeah, okay. I'd like to set up a cave to attract some local species. That way I can observe them in a more controlled environment. You can harvest uh, whatever products they produce, okay? I could either set up a cave that attracts mushrooms or fruit bats. Bats will sometimes leave fruit for you to collect. Oh. Mm. Mushrooms or bats. You know what? Let's go. I would love to have a little bat cave. Yeah, let's go for the bats. All right, I'll go set it up right now. It shouldn't take any time at all. Thanks for letting me do this. Well, I, I, I had no other choice, did I? All right, let's see. We have also a letter. Oh, hello. So, um, I hope you think this is from, uh, you know, the, the Giza, Egypt kind of thing. Anyways, uh, the specimen you delivered offered great insight into... Uh, the machinations of the fell beings we call monsters. I formulated a pugnant tincture that these beings find intoxicated. Use it with caution. M. Rasmedius, the wizard. We have um, a new crafting recipe. Monster musk. Ooh. Does that attract monsters? Probably. Um... Okay. Let's see here. We've got a snail. Oh, that's nice. We had we had some snails uh, before, but oh well. Put you in there. Go that water the cat, or you know the cat bowl. Say hi to the cat. And look at that. There is some wiggly worms up here. Boop, there we go. We've got some stones out of that. Anything else we could uh, harvest here? No, it seems like everything is, is doing all right. Uh, let's just drop those stones off. We are heading to Clint today. That was um, initially the plan. We'll see any wiggly worms. We can also drop by the beach because I don't think they have opened yet. There we go. Got some blackberries. Yeah, sure. All right. Because we're going to be delivering a chewing stick and crush some geodes. We also have quite a lot of... Um... Uh, by the way, is there anybody's birthday? Ooh, Jody's birthday. Do we know anything about her? Let's go to the new um, thingy here. Jody, my friend. We haven't given her any gifts. Oh, yeah, she hates spicy berries, so that's not good. Uh, I like the fact that we actually get, like, a little thing that shows us what they like and didn't like. Um, all 
guess so we were planning to swap by Robin today. Okay, so there are no... Or is there? Okay, so we can only pick one of them. I wonder how often they reset. Maybe once a week? Maybe? Thank you. Now let's go to Clint first. Hopefully he's home. Clint, have you dropped anything in here? Nope. Alright. Uh, it is not open yet. Oh, dang. Alright, should we... See if we can catch a fish while we wait? Let's do that. Look at the red leaves falling. That's so nice. Alright, fishy. Come on. Come on, fish. Now you're just wasting my time. There we go. Thank you. Piece of lemon squeezy. There we go. And what do we get? Small mouth bath. Okay. All right, Clint. Put on your underwear. I'm coming in. There we go. And uh, we would like to process some geodes. We have two of them. Smack that up. And we got something. Sandwich. A common type of stone with a red and brown serrations. Okay. And well. Whatever that is, Earth Crystal. Nothing interesting. I think we kind of already... Oh, hello! Hello! You know, you're kind of leading uh, uh, the marriage um, vote. You know, you can vote. There should be a link uh, down in the description. So if you would like to have, a, you know, something to say about who we're going to be marrying, uh, you can vote in a straw poll link uh, in the description. Uh, for now, Penny is uh, leading. All right, I lived in Pelican Town my whole life. Can you believe that? Sure, I can. I guess there's a lot out there I'll never experience. Yeah, but you have books. You can move into me and I'll and, and we'll share uh, an internet plan or something like that. Oh, we also had a book. Oh, we also forgot about that. Hi. <sighs> If I read this, are we gonna summon Cthulhu? Solo Ulan Po Eno Ra Kutu Ulan Kutu Ulan Mabu Bel En Ra Teban Umi Valo Nemo Duk Clan Kutu Kui Mabu Abogedu. Yoba, isn't that the god in this game? I think they call him the god. There's probably something here. Alright. Uh, Gunter, I have something for you. Uh, a chewing stick. Tell me all about it, please. Uh, where should we put that? I'll put it right next to the sword. There we go. No new rewards. Alright, so Robin was the next... Um, Plan, was it? Hello. Uh, I want to look for bugs, but mom get mad when I'm all dirty. It's a tough choice. <laughs> yeah, I guess. Uh, let's say hi. He's the mayor after all. All right, mayor. Every Wednesday, I have the buckwheat waffle and coffee for breakfast. It's still it's a little tradition I keep to keep the bachelor life interesting. Uh, yeah, yeah, you kind of sound like me, oh gosh. Yeah, the bachelor life is awful, isn't it? Alright, hello. Hi, I want to ask you something. Do you think the ladies like my haircut? Uh, it looks very fashionable. Um. Looks like some kind of fungal growth. <laughs> you know, yeah, sure. Go ahead. Enjoy, Sam. Uh, wasn't it Sam his name was? Alex, sorry. Yeah, I know. That's why I have it like this. Yeah. Uh, okay. <laughs> uh, we check those. Robin. Yeah, Robin's next. What else can we get distracted by today? Oh, blackberries. <laughs> um, yeah, there is some more blackberries up here. 
We'll take those. And... Uh, wasn't it somebody's birthday today? Oh... I think it was. I think it was Judy's birthday. We'll, uh, we'll just go into Robin real quick here as soon as I'm not being distracted by all these blackberries. Mm, yeah, that seems like a good idea. Alright. Hello! Oh, excuse me. I'm excited to see what happens with that cave, aren't you? Yeah. I hope you are pleased with the work I did. Uh, to be perfectly honest, uh, can you move? Excuse me, sir. There we go. Um, I haven't checked it, Demetrius. Uh, we probably should. Alright, what can I do for you? Uh, we would like to shop. Alright, we could buy a piece of wood, a stone, some basic windows, some birch, a calendar. Ooh, that would probably be nice. Also a workbench. What is this? When crafting here, you will have access to materials in any adjacent chests. You can also buy a telephone. I, can't. I don't have a telephone. Okay. Some new stones, new recipes, maybe? Mm, not quite sure. But man, should we spend like 2,000 on a phone? Can be used to check store hours and inventory. That could be a good idea. Okay, here's, here, okay, we're gonna, we're gonna be spending almost all our money. Alright? Alright, okay. Let's not. We'll buy the calendar and we'll buy the phone. Alright, let's do it. There we go. And the calendar. I think these are good investments. Uh, we still have 2,000 monies left. And uh, we were supposed to find. Wasn't it Jody? Can we read the calendar here? No. Now, I'm not quite sure what the, the, the phone. I, I think we can basically call them up and ask where they are at. We'll, we'll see. Alright, uh... Oh, it's not... Wait, it's the 11th. So it's tomorrow. Okay, we have all the time in the world. Alright. The girlfriend's, uh... Okay, let's go talk to her. We can catch her. Okay. What did you say? It's... Yes, it is. 12.20 p.m. already. Oh my gosh. Um, I still have a ton of work to do. Alright. How about Sam? Hey, something smells good. Like pizza. Oh, well, I might have stepped in something. Um, do you smell that? Maybe it's mom cooking something. Yeah, she's standing right next to you. Or maybe it's Pam. <laughs> Who knows? Oh, this is a person we usually don't speak to. It's a proper nerd. Excuse me, sir. Hello? Remember to cover your mouth when you sneeze. Uh, then make sure to wash your hands. Oh, how appropriate. All right, I'm so sick and tired of hearing that. <laughs> and wash your hands every day. Every time you have been somewhere. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. 2021 it is now. I was kind of hoping that it would be better, but here in Norway it started of kind of not better at all. Uh, we, we basically got um, uh, two weeks in house arrest. Happy New Year! Here you go. Two, two, uh, two, two weeks of house arrest. Yeah. <laughs> also, you're not allowed to buy alcohol now for some weird reason. Because, uh, um, you know. I mean, if you, if you just sell food, like, you can't if you go to a restaurant and, and, and you know, um, buy food. So, yeah, I, I would like to have lasagna, but I also would like to have uh, um, a beer with that. No, sorry, you can't do that. And the government are, uh, you know, saying, nope, I'm not allowed to serve beer. Yeah, but just what? Nope. nope. <laughs> oh, hello, what is this? A sea cucumber? I wonder, I think we have gotten one of those before, haven't we? This is my favorite fishing spot, by the way. Right next to this lake, uh, rock. There we go. Right, can we get a perfect uh, catch? Yep. There we go. 
more a sardine. Come on. Come on. There we go. Oh, there's a little fresh. Let's get that first. Oops, a little too eager. Hopefully there's something valuable in here. Oh, come on. Don't be that way, fishy. We can do it. There we go. Anchovy and... Drum roll, please. Oh, come on. One bait. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Alright, move it, seagull. Shoo! I'm walking here. Alright, there we go. Um... Now, should we go... Let's go through... Oh, let's talk to her. We haven't talked to her very much, have we? Hello. Uh, what's your name? Uh, Emily. My friend run a shop in the desert. If you ever go there, stop in and say hi for me. Okay. I think she sells some rare products. Ooh, I like rare products. Uh, and I also like rummaging through your trash cans. Because, you know, who knows? Um, we might find an old tampon or something like that. Who knows? <laughs> Disgusting. Shame on you, Hannibal. Shame on you. No, we were going up. Also, it's Wednesday. Isn't this the day where there is, like, a, a vendor here? I have completely forgotten. Um, that might be wrong. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Alright, I'm kind of looking forward to, um, to see what's what we can use the phone for. Like the calendar, I think that only kind of holds the birthday thing. It's gonna make it so much easier to, um, to, um, can we put it on the outside? No. I know there is some furniture you can place on the outside. Okay, we'll put you here. Okay, this is perfect. Can we, um, yeah, you come here and... We'll uh, uh, put you here. Okay, so this is the calendar. So it basically just worked like the calendar in uh, in town. But now we don't have to go through Pierre's to figure out who has a birthday. So let's say we go to tomorrow, it's the 11th. We'd say, oh, I wonder, is there somebody's birthday today? And you can check and then you can go and grab your, her birthday gift and then go and find her instead of going to Pierre, check whose birthday, oh, oh man, but I don't have that in my inventory, and then you have to travel back to the farm and then find her, yeah, so it kind of makes things a little bit easier, but this little thing here, um, yeah, I kind of also would like to, uh, yeah, let's do that, and we'll put the anchor here, and can we put the phone here? Um, okay. <laughs> Let's first see if we can use it. All right, so who can we call? We can call Robin, Clint, Pierre, Marnie, Gus, and Cancel. Let's call uh, Robin. Robin? It's uh, Robin. My business uh, hours are from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. Please come by then if you are in need of anything. Beep. Oh, we could check. Uh, oh, we could check. Oh. Oh, this is nice. Uh, we can check building upgrades cost. So we can check how much everything costs. Uh, there is one thing I would like to check, and that is... Um, this thing here allow you to cut down and store grass because we eventually gonna be growing dinosaurs. Fifteen thousand? Oh, that's a shed. Uh, five thousand. Um, yeah, I 
going to happen. 4,000. Oh man, we kind of we could afford that, I think, if we didn't spend all our money on on wonky stuff like the phone, <laughs> the calendar. Oh well, uh, things comes and goes. Uh, let's also call the other guys. Uh, Clint, hi! I just uh, installed a phone here. Uh, let's wait until he answers before we start talking. Uh, you reach Clint's uh, answering machine. I'm not available right now. My business hours are from uh, 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. Okay. Check out two upgrade costs. So we could make. Oh, that's cost 5,000. Ah. Oh. <laughs> oh. All right. What else can we. Pierre! Pierre, my friend! Oh, here's a different number. They're not all the same. Um. Thank you for calling Pierre's General Store. We're closed at the moment. Uh, but our hours are nine. Okay. And then we can check the store inventory. Very, very interesting. And Marnie. I like the old picture of the phone. That is... Absolutely sweet, I think. All right. Hello, you reached Bonnie's ranch. My business hours. Okay, so she's not home. All right, let's check the livestock price. Oh, uh, we can't buy anything. Oh, all right. Well, we have a phone. Uh, wasn't there one more Gus? Yeah, Gus. Gus. Stop, poor, poor Gus. Okay, let's see here. Oh, it's actually Gus. Hello. Hi, and well, yes, today's special is vegetable medley. We're open right now, so feel free to come in for a taste. Yeah, I kind of feel I have other things to do. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. Um, I know we kind of spent a lot of... Uh, oh, I should have probably moved this. Oh, that is actually... You know what? That is actually a feature. So, if I... How did I do that? There is a way, you see, my friend, to, um... Not like that. How did I do that? There is a way, because I have done this before. Let's see here. It's not like that. See, there is a way. Just let me think. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna say it right. You just wait and see. Um, okay. Not exit game. Controls. <laughs> um, I would like... Let's see. Invert. Whole part scroll. By the way, that's also something weird. Um, uh, shift tab inventory. Okay, so we would like to have you press any key. Is there a way we could move these chests? Mm, not, not for the fishing pole. Yeah, there we go. So we just need to have an empty hand, so now we should be able to walk around here. Oh, so much work <laughs> for so little effort. All right. Um, we have something we can store in here, and you we can also store in here. I wonder, like these artifacts here, do we need them? Ancient drum, for example. 
I'm not quite sure, but I kind of am not quite willing to, uh, to, um, to throw them away either. You know what? I know what we're going to do. We are going to be, uh, okay, let's go, okay, let's go, okay, listen, listen up, let's go. Go back here, dial Robin, Robin, my friend. Do, 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 do. All right. Yeah, and we we get to the answer. Oh, we also can see the heart level of Robin. Um, what was it? We can also be House of Prince. Uh, that was not quite what I was willing to do. Uh, check inventory. Check building upgrade costs. Because we could potentially build a silo. 100 gold, 10 clay, and 5 copper bars. Okay. 100, 10, and 5. Let's see if we have that. Let's get that ready for tomorrow. And we'll get our first thing up and running. Okay, so 100 stone. Oh, come on, we don't have a hundred stone? <laughs> you must be kidding with me, right? We only have 49 stone. Oh, all right, we'll, we'll spend the rest of the day fishing. Oh, what a waste of time. <laughs> what a waste of time. Oh, well. Still have a little time left. Green algae. Let's try the other side. Also, I'm not quite sure. Did we put the bait in here today? I don't think we did. Soggy newspaper. I think we did. All right. All right, fishy. Get over here. Maybe we should also go and have a look and see what Demetrius did in the cave. He made a bat cave. I hope the Batmobile is in there. There we go. Oh. We'll focus on getting that. And then we'll grab you. Maybe something good can come from this. And one piece of bait. Well, it is something. All right, after this fish here, we'll go and check the, the bat cave. See if he, uh, he gave us a batmobile as well. Maybe Alfred is waiting there. Hello, Mr. Uh, oh, gosh, what is he called? Batman? Oh, why can't I remember? It? William Wallace? No, that's somebody else. <laughs> I remember what his name is. Ah. Uh. Wayne. Wayne. Mr. Wayne. Wayne. Wayne Enterprise. William Wayne. Oh, man. <laughs> Don't hate me, folks. All right, so where's the Batmobile? There's nothing here! Oh, there is. Ooh. Wait, oh, yeah, there is bats here. But they were fruit bats, and I, I don't think fruit bats are that scary. <laughs> yeah, kind of cute. Kind of cute. They have the, their mm -hmm. face kind of looks like a dog. Mm -hmm. So spooky dogs with wings. Yeah, that's... Alright, come on, fishy. Here we go. Got a new record, smallmouth bass. Let's just dump those in here. Or the other chest. Uh, bait goes in here. And also you. Okay. And then we can go to bed. Wait. So, cat, cat. Okay. So yeah, I think that is going to be it for today. I uh, really hope you like this episode. Ooh, was, uh, 
an owl sound. Huh. But yeah, I really hope you liked this episode. If you did, don't be afraid to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. But most of all, don't forget to keep smiling. <laughs>